Well, good morning again, good morning. everyone, and welcome to worship at Deadridge Baptist Church. Uh, we're here celebrating what is the beginning of Easter week, uh, Palm Sunday, when we think about our Lord's approach to the temple and to Jerusalem on the donkey. Um, but we're here together and we're with you and we're hoping and trusting. This is an act of faith that you're there uh, celebrating with us. We hope all is well with uh, everyone in the fellowship. We've been phoning around, the deans and myself, and we still feel everyone is in good spirits, although we're beginning to feel the weight of confinement and being stuck in our own homes. But nevertheless, uh, we're here together this morning. And while those things that are going on around us uh, are a little chilling and worrying, nevertheless, we have something to uh, buoy up our hope, and that is uh, our Lord Jesus Christ. So, as we're gathered for worship, we're going to begin appropriately with prayer. I've asked Sheena if she would take the prayer this morning. It's a prayer that's been sent to me. It's a prayer that was prayed during World War II when the nation was in difficulties and there were those that were suffering and in many, many cases, as we know, dying. I'm thinking this morning in our prayers of those who are struggling with the COVID-19 situation. Uh, thinking of the families of those that are struggling as well with it, that have caught it. And we're wanting to pray this morning, thinking of those particularly who are suffering because of this situation. So I've asked Sheena if she would lead us in prayer. So Sheena, let's pray. The light of God surrounds you. The love of God enfolds you. The power of God protects you. The presence of God watch over you. The mind of God guide you. The law of God direct you. Wherever we are, God be our strength and harbour. In Jesus' name, Amen. Amen. Right, well, I'm turning to the scripture, not to read the whole passage, but it's the triumphal entry uh, recorded by Mark. And we know that the Lord Jesus comes to Bethphage and Bethany at the Mount of Olives, he sends two of his disciples off to prepare uh, things and to collect a donkey. Uh, he then makes his way toward Jerusalem. And we read from verse 7 of Mark 11 that many people spread their cloaks on the road while others spread branches that they'd cut in the fields. Those who went ahead and those who followed shouted, Hosanna! Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Blessed is the coming kingdom of our father David. Hosanna in the highest. And we read that Jesus entered Jerusalem and went into the temple. Now, to help us imaginatively engage with this passage, I'm going to ask you to uh, press pause and come out of this recording and go into a recording that has been prepared for us by Abbey Road Studios of Edinburgh. It's a little skit that, that helps us imaginatively engage with what was happening at this time. See you just a little later. 